we're the members of the National Association of Rocketry. Back in 1958, a young guy named Harry Stein saw a need for a group to help people have fun flying rockets safely. The world was in the midst of a space race back then, and there was a national effort to guide young people into technical and engineering careers. We saw education as our primary mission then, and we've stayed on that trajectory ever since. Along the way, we've supported all kinds of rocketry, from simple sport flyers to advanced competition flying, and even high-power rockets that travel to the edge of space. We were leaders in STEM learning before anyone could even spell the word. One of our earliest young members rode his NAR experience all the way into space, four times. Today finds us in a different kind of space race, and the need for young people with solid STEM skills has never been greater. National Association of Rocketry members can be found mentoring the technical leaders of tomorrow who will soon join that mission. Together with our allies at the Aerospace Industries Association, we're now in our 20th year of the American Rocketry Challenge. This remarkable program allows young people to create and run their very own aerospace program, with over 85,000 students participating over the last two decades. A NAR member recently noted that the next person who sets foot on the moon will have launched a model rocket as part of their journey. We're proud of the mark that National Association of Rocketry members have made on the story of American aerospace and look forward to the next chapters in that story that the young people here today will help write.